for that TwitchCon recently. <laughs> it's super, it's super nice. Oh yeah. Yeah. They gave out like the at like the TwitchCon 2018 or so, just for free for all the Twitch partners and stuff. Pretty cool. Very comfy. Alrighty. Looks like we're getting into it now. No, not quite. Okay, Nico's got to do his controls. Gotta get his tag and, and all that stuff. That's the new tag, by the way. Eat. <laughs> I'm surprised his controls aren't already in here, but yeah. I guess not. I guess they are. Here's what it is. I don't know if use the same sub, like, every single, for, for stream every single time. Who knows, really? It looks like it's starting PS2, which, I don't know stage that, that I, that's honestly benefit from, um, like, a control. It's like, it's probably, probably a good bet. And he's not even going. He's going to Lucina. Ooh. Interesting. I know Le Nico sometimes likes to bust out his secondaries. Uh, he's, he was going Falcon for a while. <laughs> we all remember those dark. Dark Times. Paladin 420. Oh, yeah. That's, that's the name. Yeah, yeah. Good old Xbox Live user names. Mine was also embarrassing, so it's okay. Yeah, yeah. Scorpion <laughs> Master 13 and all that. We, we, we don't talk about those days. But hey, yeah. It looks like we're getting into it here. I can uh, see this matchup being actually being pretty, uh, pretty decent for the scene even still, though. Because, like, Ness is not, like, swords in his face. And on, I think I'm not even sure if this will work entirely, but I know you can. You might be, you might be able to just straight up counter his uh, recovery, like if you get rocket back to the stage. It could be a thing. I'm not too sure though, but yeah, I guess I, time will tell. I think one of uh, uh, Ness's biggest strengths is just his, his disjoints, and when you have a bigger disjoints, the joint that sort of takes it away from him. Oh yeah. And this, yes. Oh, he is a jump. Okay. Oh, and he's basically. I would. Good angle there though. Feel like. Nico definitely could have killed him there. No, it wasn't not really. That they drop down counter or something like that. No, even he, he couldn't counter. He couldn't get the angle there because he went to if he went too close to the stage. He just grabbed the ledge instead. Uh, I see. And, and also in, in that case, like the, the angle makes it really hard for like for anyone to really get down there in the first place. That's why it's necessary to recover from that angle. Uh -huh. I played Corrin in the last game, and uh, let's just say that matchup is not good for Ness. Oh, okay, we're good. Through. Okay. Bad match was not good for Ness because uh, you can actually straight up uh, carry pick a rocket and it'll kill him at zero. Oh. So a lot of time, like whenever I play in Ness, they just recover that angle. <laughs> so now, now I know. Oh, that was that nice. Was, yeah. You have a few frames to get a second pick a rocket off the stage like that. So that was, that was good. Yeah, Rip oh, I like that though. Stuff. I like I the recovery, but I like the swag. I like the mix up there. That was. I mean, you. You died, but at least it was cool. At least it was really cool. <laughs> That's the most. But then again, you died to like F smash at the left. <laughs> mm -hmm. And yeah, Nico's been just juggling ribs so well here. He's gotten so much damage. We're just uh, boxing him out. Oh, oh, good coverage, to say at least. Freeze frame of a child getting slashed by a sword. Very sad. <laughs> Very sad. This is what it is. Ness has made a str stronger stuff, though. He'll be okay. Exactly. With all of he you worried out there. Exactly. Like, man, man saved the world, and no one even knew it. All by all by himself. Then along, eventually, along with three of his friends, he got this. Her found a great game. Yeah. Uh, Ribs has shown some uh, adaptation. I, uh, the last game he was on set here. He lost the first set pretty handily. Um, now we've got a counter pick. Uh, he has had some time to figure out what Nico's doing here with uh, Lucina. So we're going to see. Honestly, he's able to do the same thing. I don't really like the FD pick too much. I feel like this might be hard for him to approach. And oh. easier for Lucina to do stuff like that. I think it's hard against sword characters because you don't want to give them platforms to just kind of hide under and like make your life miserable but at the same time like you said this is not a great pick either yeah with f especially in the nature of fd it's so it saves no platforms and it, a lot of time when i see Ness try approaching this game they're trying to like aerial pk pk fire them which is like it's, it seems like a pretty good option and like a lot of them do it off like they'll like cancel on the platform and not be able to be punished that way too well so in this case like Ribs is kind of forced to approach from the stage. Yeah, it's re-grab there. 
Rich is kind of forced to approach this stage because there's no platforms to protect his approach or anything or anything like that. So he's kind of just has to. I don't know what he has to do here, honestly. Uh, he has to actually get the stock. Oh yeah. Some damage. Oh, that was a nice delay there with the BK fire. He would have died otherwise. But... Yeah, Rips is doing amazingly off stage, but it... well, I guess Nico was able to get some of those reads, but it still hasn't been enough here. Nico has just been able to win neutral so handily and put on so much damage and disadvantage that it really doesn't matter that Rips is able to come up with these creative recoveries. Yeah, exactly. Like, I do like his recoveries, but a lot of them seem, like, all of them haven't been really too necessary, I guess. Well, I That's mean, cool. yeah. I mean, it's cool that he can do it in the first place, but it doesn't matter in this case. He's gone. And, yeah, that was, that was rough. That was pretty rough. If I, if I'm ribs right now,